To make it in cannabis, you must first dare to. 12 years ago, MJ BizCon dared to unite the global cannabis community, igniting a movement that continues to thrive. The wait is over. Let's grow together this November 28th through December 1st in Vegas. You'll hear incredible stories, see groundbreaking innovations, and forge connections that you'll need to thrive in 2024. But wait, the clock is ticking. Get your tickets by September 28th and save up to $200. And here's a secret. Podcast listeners get 10% off with promo code 23POD10. That's 23POD10. Don't miss out. Get your tickets at mjbizcon.com. That's mjbizcon.com. So by you doing this program, it's going to get other people involved that then may not have been, maybe buy it here and there. But if you believe in it like I do, then they sell it, then you're going to expand this so much quicker across the world because other people's involvement. I mean, that's just where it's at. It's really smart of you while you're also giving people a lot of money to do this for you. Welcome to the Miracle Plant Podcast, the show that inspires, promotes, and gives you a daily dose of inspiration from the people who have used cannabis to change their lives in extraordinary ways. Here's your host, Justin Benton. Welcome back to the Miracle Plant Podcast, where we discuss this miracle plant with so many names and how it's helping people in so many extraordinary ways. Well, guess what? We have an amazing guest that I got to be on her podcast and her show, and now she gets to come over here to the Miracle Plant Podcast. Her name is Debbie Bettendorf. It's called Find It. So I encourage you to go find it and listen to it. She has amazing guests like yours truly, but many other doctors and just amazing people that she's found along her journey. And I didn't get to get into her journey while I was on her podcast. She was gracious enough for me to share mine. I want to hear your story, Debbie. Welcome to the Miracle Plant Podcast. Tell us what you're all about. Thank you, Justin. I really appreciate you having me on. I loved you on my show and now here I am on yours. Um, My story is I was really delved into being a mother and a wife for a lot of years. Um, that was the, my soul's purpose. I just felt so filled up and so amazing just being a community, you know, support the community at the school with my kids. Um, and then fast forward through the years of me building them up to get ready to go fly away. And I realized, oh my gosh, I've invested all of my emotion and time into these kids and I don't even have a relationship with myself. I don't know where I want to go from here, what I want to do from here. And by the way, who the heck am I? So I was on a soul searching journey for a few years of trying to discover who I was as this grown adult that has been a wife and mother. And that was my identity for so many years, but I, it filled me up and I enjoyed it. But then I was at a place in my life where I was, my soul's purpose was changing and I had to go find it. So um, I, I had started a little um, side gig business when my son was in high school. He's the oldest because I was feeling that, that change already, knowing that I needed to do something else. And so I, did an, I started an image consulting business loved it. I'm still currently doing that as well as a lot of other things. Um, and it felt good to like put myself out there and make, uh, you know, understand that I, my role as a wife and mother could still happen, but I needed to spread myself into other areas. So I started that in 2015. And then, and, um, I, I, I decided in 2018, 19, that I would start another company called Schultz and Bettendorf Corporation. And I do a lot of marketing and advertising for other small businesses. And I love doing that. I had a lot of large clients there, Uh, did that for a few years. I'm putting that on the back burner right now, Justin, because I wrote a book 
And after I wrote the book that was inspired by my image consulting, the book is called Find Your Fabulous, which is also the name of my image consulting company. And I started going on podcasts, talking about why I wrote the book, what the book was about. And then I met Ken Walls through Mindy Dreyer, who is a dear friend of mine. And I got into the Grow Live Academy and Ken said, you should do your own podcast. And I was like, oh, I got to learn how to do it. I got to have everything, you know, type A. <laughs> He's like, just do it. So I started the podcast a little better than a year ago. And that's going really well. And then something I've always wanted to do was have a boutique because I help people get dressed and find what looks good on their bodies, but I've always put them in other people's clothes. So kind of the missing puzzle piece was selling my own clothes and I can put people in those. So that is launching in October. So I'm getting all the finalities done now. I did a soft launch, it's all online. So for someone who went from worried about going online to do a podcast that's now launching a business that's also online, it's a big step. <laughs> so that's what I have coming up is launching the online boutique in October. Well, that sounds amazing. And I just, uh, I know that like most of, of our audience that are listening and we, you know, we obviously own a hemp company and we talk about the benefits of, of cannabis and this miracle plant are like, you're our perfect demographic. We have done it. We don't talk about age, but we talk about, you know, where you are in your life. And we have seen so many people, you know, you know, go with what you're going through and, and you know, rediscovering themselves and trying to understand what is the next, you know, phase in my life. And because, you know, obviously I have four children and, and a wife and and her main goal is raising those kids. And, you know, I'm there right there with them. And and that's part of the beauty of being an entrepreneur is that you don't have to go to a you know nine to five job or. Uh, you can spend as much time as possible with your children, which was an important decision that we made. Um, but, you know, you being in that in that, you know, absolute ideal avatar, as you know, is what it's called, is amazing that our paths crossed. And it's just amazing to see you have like this, you know, this second uh, the second life that you get to live and and, you know, have your podcast and your book and your businesses. And, and tell us a little bit more about what's happening in October. OK, so the exciting part is. Uh, it, because what happened was you, back in the day, like back, say a decade ago, I thought, oh, I want a boutique and it's going to be so cute and it's going to be a brick and mortar and all of that. Well, now at this point in my life and my kids are out and about and my daughter's finishing up law school. My son works at a hospital and uh, he's in psychology. And I thought, I don't want to be married to a brick and mortar. I, I want to be able to have flexibility. I've always been on someone else's schedule. I want to be able to travel and go and do things. I mean, I'm on location right now at my daughter's apartment. You know, I went, I came to see her. And so if I had a brick and mortar, I wouldn't be able to do that unless I had really good help. So I thought, okay, I can do this online. I, I'm seeing people do it very successfully. So this boutique will be all online. I'll do streaming where you can see the clothes in motion. I'll wear them. I'll have models come in and wear them. So just like you and I sitting here right now, Justin, I'll dress you up. <laughs> it's only women's clothes. I won't dress you up. <laughs> but, you know, it'll be just like this. And I'll talk to, the, to, to my customers and they'll be able to order right as I'm talking to them. And I am pumped about it. I am super excited to give this a whirl. And I think it'll be really successful. Well, I love it. And it's so much changed for us because we we had multiple uh, brick and mortars pre-COVID. And we had uh, franchise plans in place. We had expansion uh, overseas in place. And then the whole world stopped spinning. And then it shifted. We were conditioned to shop online first. It was about 17% of Americans shopped online first. And when by first, I mean, they already were getting the groceries delivered. They were already using Uber Eats. We were all already using Amazon, but they were yeah. really using Internet first for their shopping uh, experiences. But then that number quadrupled uh, through COVID. We just were all conditioned to do that. So I think it's a fantastic idea. Uh, that's how I met Ken Walls, you know, Grow Live Academy, which is where we met. And, uh, you know, teaching you to do exactly what we're doing right now, going live and making sure the camera's eye level and, and all those kinds of things. And, um, you know, and obviously, you know, we've had, I've had Ken on a bunch of times and he's awesome. And, 
and amazing. So yeah, I can't wait to see. I think it's a great idea. I, I have some friends that are in the commercial real estate space. And I said, man, I would, and I've owned commercial real estate and, I, and I'm like, man, I would not want to be in commercial real estate unless I could get it rezoned for residential because boy, the overhead and everything that goes along with selling in the physical world. I mean, I knew even when I was opening new stores, I knew the days were numbered before COVID. Mm -hmm. I knew that, you know, I always got one year leases. And I was like, cause I never, I knew the shift was going to happen, but it happened in COVID. So it is all about how are, how can you um, get people's attention? And, and, and I think shopping online with boutiques is fantastic. So where can people find it when, uh, when this is live and up and running? The name of the company is Studio 11, the number 11 style. And I have a website and it's not fully stocked yet. I'm, I'm in the process of doing that all through September so that I can launch it grand opening on October 1st. That's a Sunday. But if you, I'm going to have an app, it's just in the final stages so that if it's all going to be on all social media platforms, um, like TikTok, Instagram and Facebook, but the app is where it's at really. That way, if you see Studio 11 style and you kind of like that style, you can just download the app and always, you won't miss any of the lives. You won't miss any of the deals. It'll notify you. So that should be done in a couple of days and I'll just promote that. But right now, if somebody wanted to check it out, they can go to studio11style.com and, um, and look at my why and look at the story that's there. So love it, love it, love it. Well, our paths crossed again when I was on your podcast, find it or your show, I should say. And I, um, I, I sent you some product in the mail. It's just something I do on the mission to heal the world and reach a billion people by 2025. And you reached back out to me and you were just like, oh my gosh, this stuff is amazing. You want to tell our audience what uh, I do you want to tell your audience yeah. and I'm going to tell my audience. Yes. So I have it right here. Handy dandy raw and renew. Let me just tell you, you sent this to me and then also some oil mm -hmm. to put under your tongue. Okay. So I used that and I was like, oh, you know, the people, I think people think me being, I'll speak for myself thought, well, that'll make me woozy. That'll make me feel funny. That no, it didn't. When I use, I used it because I thought, you know what? I want to know this product because Justin's going to be on my show, and it was amazing. And I and then the I want to talk about Raw Renew again. But then the roll up ball, the roller ball for joint pain. I took that to my parents' house and put it on my dad's knees, and he was like, "Can you get me some of that?" Mm -hmm. I'm like, "100." So I got him some, but it. It really works. And knowing that it's not woo woo, it's not some horrible thing that sometimes I don't know where we got to that point where we are in this day and age where people I'm not going to get on a rant, but a little one real quick. People are taking prescription pills, meth, heroin, but all of a sudden CBD oil and, and cannabis is the devil. I'm like, Okay, the more I've read about it, and I really got an education because I knew you were coming on the show. And I knew who you were because I heard you speak, and I knew your story about your son. And that really got me interested. So I started researching it more, and the more I found out was like, oh my gosh, this is a natural way to help people. Okay, so now fast forward. The only thing I didn't use that you sent me until much later, I f kind of forgot I had it, if I'm being real, is this gem, Raw Renew. And so I was, I was in my little, you know, how women have a whole stash of like, I've got this moisturizer and I've got this. And I'm like, oh, I'm going to use this. So I opened it up and I rubbed it on my face and I was like, it has granules. Oh, shoot. I think this is an exfoliator. Then I looked again. I'm like, no, it isn't. You're supposed to rub. And I rubbed it in on my face. The granules warmed up and melted into my face. And I was like, I, my cleansed face and I put it on. I was like, I look fabulous. <laughs> and I was like, with time, what will this do? Like, 
I was jacked up about it and excited. And so, and when you read in there and it, it's organic and it's, it, it's all the real, real stuff from mother earth. And that made me more excited than anything. So I did, I reached out to you and I said, what is this madness? I need some of it. I need a vat of it so I can put my whole body in it. I want affiliated with this in some way. So now tell them what you're doing. Well, so here's the crazy thing. As we're recording the podcast this week, we have just launched our affiliate program called Brand Ambassadors, what it's been called for 1.0 and 2.0, where we're launching 3.0. And uh, <laughs> the first the first go around, uh, we were just so excited um, for Brand Ambassadors and we were all like meeting and talking on Zoom calls and having all kinds of fun. And then and then we did a 2.0 launch, which was we were giving away, you know, if you posted like three times a month, we would give away like $50 of free CBD bucks. And we had contests that CBD you could win. Bucks. Yeah, you could win like, <laughs> uh, you know, greatest hits with all of our most popular products. And then you could, you know, we'd have like, you know, gift card giveaways and things like that, which was fun. And then that one kind of, you know, fizzled down. So, but then, you know, obviously I worked with Russell Brunson and helping him with his big next launch called Secrets of Success. And, um, you know, we are launching an incredible um, commission structure for the affiliates over there. And as I was learning uh, over there and I was like, whoa, I was like, okay, you know, and that's the whole thing, you know, it's about modeling. So I was like, well, then I'm just going to look at this amazing, aggressive affiliate commission structure and I'm going to put it in place for 3.0. So that's what I did. And, and most people don't even know about it. Um, and, and basically how it works is you get, uh, you're going to be able to get 30% commission. So it can be, you know, either look at it like you're getting a 30% discount or if anyone who uses your link, you immediately get commission. And then if they go and they shop through your link, you get 30%. But the cool thing that I didn't know about it until I saw how it worked with Russell was that there's actually software out there and that we use now that can track not only your link, but then anybody that signs up using your link to become an affiliate or a brand ambassador, you get 15% of whatever they buy or sell or use right. from other people that buy through them. So it's just a cool second level of extra income. So not only are you on a mission to heal the world, but you're actually getting paid to heal the world. So we'd never done that before. And then, like I said, I just followed Russell's lead and I said, well, if it's good enough for Russell, it's good enough <laughs> for me. And once I understood how it worked and how to use the software, we put that in place. So that is launched right now. And you can go to boosthealthwealth.com and get signed up. And someone like you, who I think's already signed up, if you go there and it's already signed up, then you could, it'll just, you know, it'll basically, you just need to log back into your uh, OSI is the name of the software that we use. And any questions, just reach out to us at info at 101cbd.org and we'll make sure you get all signed up and any questions. And uh, Kristen Selby Gonzalez is running that. So yes, we're so excited to have you. You're going to be the queen of Raw Renew and getting out there and telling everybody about it and getting paid. So why not? Because, you know, we all have bills to pay. So why not get paid yeah. in the process? And this stuff is magic. I mean, not only is it a skin rejuvenator, uh, it's all organic ingredients. Th those those, those um, exfoliating uh, bumps that you thought was actually just mango butter. Sometimes in the uh, shipment in the in the in the summertime, the mango butter melts and then it and then it cools. Yeah. So we always just say, warm it up, put it back in the fridge, and it'll be fine. And it's all. I love the green milks because it yeah. helps. Like yeah. make, it like really gets in there. I love yeah. it. But yeah, you're right. When it's too warm, yeah. Then it I, then it just um, it melts. But I am telling. And some of my friends have smelled it and said, I'm not sure about the smell. Mm -hmm. I love it. Yeah. I even love the smell. Well, I'm like, and there's no artificial smells or flavors or chemicals or yeah. any of that. It's just mango it's so butter. Clean. Yeah. If you look on the bottom of it, there should be the ingredients on there. And there is yeah, just, the yeah, there's, if yeah. you look well, at it, I read it, yeah, it's just a hundred percent organic, natural yeah. ingredients. There's, um, and, and it's just amazing. And, and the main power is the raw hemp. The raw hemp is full of vitamin E. Uh, it's, it's the greatest anti-inflammatory. It helps with homeostasis, which is balancing each cell. So like, if you look at like, if you've got like beauty marks or, or wrinkles or, uh, you know, cold sores, you name it, scratches, bumps, you know rashes. You said even, even a sunburn. Even, oh, the sunburns, unbelievable. I bring it every time I go on a big like business trip with a bunch of people, you know, for a conference or whatever, like funnel hacking lives coming up. Um, then I always bring samples and I give it to everybody before we go to Mexico and things like that, because everyone gets burned 
the first couple of days, a lot of people do. And then I give it to them and they're all red. And then I give it to them the next day that they're not. And they're like, oh my gosh, the sunburn is gone. And it's amazing yeah, it's what this plant can do. True. I mean, it's just, I am obsessed with this. Like I, and I buy a lot of high end products for my face and my body. And the other, I've been using this also on my legs where there's sun damage. I mean, and, and as you age too, you get, you know, the skin isn't as like, I don't know, it's not as good. Let's just say it's not as good. I put it on there and I used it for two weeks and my, I look amazing. I mean, I just got to be real. I'm like, I need, because it's real. Here's the good thing. So by you doing this program, it's going to get other people involved that then may not have been, maybe buy it here and there. But if you believe in it, like I do, then they sell it. Then you're going to expand this so much quicker across the world because other people's involvement. I mean, that's just where it's at. It's really smart of you while you're also giving people a lot of money to do this for you. They're reaping the benefits, but in the end, you're just going to grow so massively that that the program is, is a good thing to do for you. Well, and that's what I was saying, just like with your online boutique, times have changed. I mean, if COVID hadn't happened, we would probably have 10 to 15 stores throughout the country and throughout the world. Um, which would have been fine. And we would have uh, been stocked up on shelves at chiropractors as we already were, but it just was such a shift. And, and it was like, and I knew it was coming, but I didn't know, you know, COVID sped it up so quick. And so now it's like, okay, so what's the next, what's the next phase? It's online. It's going viral. It's, it's having podcasts. It's, it's, you know, and it's letting people do word of mouth. Look, we can have the best product in the world, which we do because it's raw hemp, but no one else sells it. No one else understands the power of it. Um, you know, obviously you listening right now, you do because you're a podcast listener of the miracle plant, but 99% of the country has no idea what raw CBDA is and when it works, it works. And so, and that's why I'm so excited to have you excited about it out there. And we'll be, you know, pushing and promoting this podcast and put it in some ads and things like that. That's the biggest challenge for us with CBD, as you well know, as you just opened a box of it on TikTok of all places and tell them what happened oh. when you just, I don't even I, know if you even mentioned the word CBD or hemp on your TikTok. I didn't. Okay. So, um, didn't think one thing about it, but was really impressed. I love packaging. I love presentation. I love to give gifts that look pretty just to even open them. So when you sent me my gifts to try out prior to you being on Find It, I opened my, and it was a beautiful miracle plant box and it opened like this. And then you had like green confetti in it and all the items were sitting so neatly in there. And I was like, oh, heard angels singing. I'm like, this is Picasso. So I was like, oh, I'm going to video the box and the stuff that's in it. So I took just a little video. I never said anything. I didn't have music, playing, nothing. And I just videoed and I opened the box as I videoed. And I'm like, oh, I put this on TikTok. Posted the video on TikTok. It was on. I had people looking at it. And then all of a sudden, it was gone. My video was gone. And I was like, what? So I looked into it into my account they had sent me TikTok had sent me a message saying that that video was banned because it was promoting like drugs i don't know i don't the wording i can't remember what the wording was but basically it was saying that i was promoting illegal substances and i was like i cannot believe this and then it dawned on me on a whole other level of what you go through justin trying to get the word out about an all natural good for you product that is from mother earth it's not prescription pills that people are getting addicted to and all the nastiness but they took my video down just crazy and 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 that's another reason why like so all these amazing things i've learned in in the click funnels and uh russell brunson community like you know, a lot of it and, you know, a lot of the people that have had success over the last five years, 10 years, did it through um, paid ads, Facebook ads, Instagram ads. Yeah. And we just tried so hard so many times and we had so many accounts shut down um, that we just finally said this enough, enough is enough. We just not. And then 
uh, as as it would happen to be, Facebook and Apple got in a fight, and so the tracking from Facebook on iPhones went away, and then the prices um, for Facebook ads went through the roof. So now everyone is kind of experiencing what I uh, went through, which what is you, you got to do organic things. This is organic. Having a podcast is organic. Having a YouTube channel, you know, doing YouTube videos is organic. This podcast is going to be short reels, 60 seconds and less. Those things go organic and go viral. And that's what we're doing with this new 3.0 launch where you're heading it off with the, with the raw renew is we're just going to organically get recruit or have people sign up. We've already got over, I, I think, 600 people that are already in the program. So we're getting them wow. re-signed up with the 3.0 launch and um, and then just let them go out there. And like I said, the CBD bucks were fun and the free products were fun. The gift cards were fun. But now we're just paying people like, here you go. Let's go make some money. Let's go heal the world. Let's go pay our bills and, and then some because as, as a lot of us know, you know, the economy is not in the greatest of places. Um, and so having a side hustle, having some extra income is only going to help. So I'm just so excited that uh, we met, you fell in love with Raw Renew and that we can get out there and, and really make a difference because this product's only going to help people and, and break through the stigmas and have great skin. And, and, and then the other thing, too, is like it, it helps, you know, we're talking about the skin, but even the Raw Renew is going to help with pain. I mean, it, and pain yeah. and inflammation. Well, inflammation, and that's huge. And what I've noticed too is when I, and I've been traveling, so I haven't been as regimen with it, but, and I haven't slept very well, but when I do use it under my eyes, the swelling goes away very, very quickly um, after I get up in the mornings. But I was also going to ask you, well, first of all, what was, there was something I had in my head I wanted to ask you, but one thing I do want you to mention is the difference between CBD or because while I love this product, okay, because it's all about the skin and everything, I don't have a lot of aches and pains, right? So while the oil and the CBD oil, all of that stuff and the roller ball to put on stuff, that's amazing. And I tested it on people who do have pain and they got relief. But for me, the reason I'm like super into this is because this is something I feel like I need right now to help my skin, to repair my skin for wrinkles and just sun damage and stuff. But all the other products are amazing as well. In your production, Justin, what is different about the way you process versus other places? Great question. And then that really is the difference. Number one, we don't process. So it's not processed. Uh, essentially, it's cold pressed. So uh, it's, you know, a more technical term is called cold extraction, anything less than 100 and like 14 degrees Fahrenheit. Uh, but ours is lower than that. But what you're doing is essentially you're like juicing the plant, really. And when you, when you put the, the raw hemp in, into the press, it actually, when you press down on it, you know, we're talking, you know, hundreds of pounds of, of hemp and you press down on it on the outside on, and, and then on the, through the, the, the output is like a honey, believe it or not. So that oil is a, is a really concentrated honey substance and that is raw hemp. And that is filled with 512 plant constituents. So it's just like a honey when you press down on the plant that comes out and 99% of the other companies, when they are doing that pressing, they're either applying heat. And so they're, when you could apply heat to raw hemp, it turns the raw material into what's a fancy word called decarboxylated or turns the CBDA, which is what the plant makes into CBD. Now CBD is still good. Don't get me wrong, but Dr. Raphael Mishulam, the godfather of cannabinoid medicine proved through research that it's, the raw CBDA is up to a thousand times more uh, effective because our bodies know what to do with raw plant material versus heated cooked things. And so that's that's the difference. And, and the world doesn't really understand that. Only like the most sophisticated cannabis uh, experts would understand that. And so that's part of the mission is just to educate people. Why does our because a lot of people have tried CBD now, which is great. The problem is half of the products out there aren't very good. They're made of isolated, overprocessed white powder junk, kind of like the pharmaceutical model. Um, and so we're losing them because they just said, oh, I tried it, didn't work. So that's the part that stinks. But, um, you know, they estimate around 25 percent of the country has had some experience with CBD. So 12 and a half percent of the country think it's great because they tried a great product like ours. Uh, unfortunately, the other, what, 87.5 percent either haven't tried it or tried something crappy. So we've got a lot of work to do, but we've come a long way. Well, it's interesting that you say that because I'll share a little story. So my dad's brother, so my uncle, um, has tried the crappy stuff 
and wasn't a big, wasn't a fan and just thought it doesn't really work. It's, I overpay for this product that's, it's a bunch of malarkey. So I get yours. I then buy another order because I wanted another rollerball for my dad. And I thought, I'm going to get the oil too. Gave it to my uncle and said, free, take it, try it. Tell me what you think. Uh, multiple orders he has placed since that time. He said, this is the real deal. I can't believe it. I never would have gone and probably tried anything else because it's overpriced and it wasn't really working, but he has purchased yours. So there's another testimony there just in my own little circle that made me really want to be involved. Um, knowing you, knowing your story and understanding the way that your product is made, not processed. I'll remember that. Um, who wouldn't want to be a part of that? That's the way I feel about it. Heck yeah. Well, I'm, I'm glad you got, you got bit by the miracle plant bug because, <laughs> you know, so many people that actually come to us, um, you know, we obviously started with, you know, helping heal our son with autism, with a great diet, food allergy tests and detoxifying his body and, and working on the inflammation in his brain. So his body could, could detoxify and heal itself. Um, and so that was, that's how we got started. And it was never a business. It was always, it's always been a dot org. And so we, you know, at the end of the day, thought we were just going to tell our story to give hope for other families affected by autism. And then it just, it kept spiraling when then it was fibromyalgia, then it was rheumatoid arthritis, neuropathy. And then when cancer hit about five years ago, when someone came in and used only our product um, to treat their cancer um, because she was German from Germany and lived here. And she was like, you know, I've tried it all. I've been through chemo, radiation. I said, she said, I'd rather die than go through it again. And these are, these are powerful words. And I, at the time, didn't even know, like, to me, cancer was a death sentence. I didn't know much about it five, six years ago. And so, um, but she just took the product and came back, you know, every month and got another bottle. And we do a compassionate program. It's 50% off for any, 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 you know, severe issues like that. And uh, she just kept coming back. And after like month three, I finally asked her, got out the courage and said, so how are you? And, you know, she was like, well, I'm playing tennis and she's in her seventies and she's like, life's good. I said, great. Well, how about how about the thing or whatever? She's like, oh yeah, I just got back from UCLA. I have a clean bill of health. She had stage four, I uh, believe it was colon cancer. And it, it, in that, when that happened and, and I was like, okay, this is nuts. Cause at, at the end of the day, like I said, it answered my prayers for my son. I saw what it did for rheumatoid arthritis, neuropathy, fibromyalgia, all things I didn't know what they were five or six years ago. And, and now um, when, you, when I saw the thing with cancer, I was like, okay, so the world does not know about this stuff. They need to know. I've had Dr. William Courtney on, if you listen to a previous podcast, um, you know, he is the world's leading researcher and doctor on raw cannabis, raw hemp, and uh, how it was treating cancer. And it kills, it kills cancer cells. It shrieks tumors. That's part of what you're doing when you put the raw or new on your skin. If there's any irregularities, that's cancer is an irregularity. So it will notify that your cell, it will actually, um, there's every cancer cell has a kill code and it will actually uh, trigger the kill code of the cancer. So that's why if you have like a wart or a cold sore or, or any weird um, blemish on your skin, start rubbing that on, even varicose veins. It's crazy because this is telling your body to find homeostasis, which means balance. Every cell knows what it's supposed to be due to environmental toxins or, you know, whatever, sun, things like that. Uh, our bodies, you know, tend to not find that that perfect cell but this plant helps remind it helps reset the cell to what it was supposed to be so again i'm so excited that you found this plant and you got excited about this plant because i know you're going to do a heck lot of, of just telling other people about it you've got an incredible story an incredible platform so i'm just uh, so excited to meet and have you on the show any final words uh, before we wrap up it's a miracle. No, <laughs> it's a miracle. Um, yeah, I just want to say thanks for having me. And I look forward to working with you and spreading the word about this, this amazing product, the miracle plant. And that's all really. And where can they find your show? Where can they find your uh, boutique again? Okay, so you can find it is my podcast on YouTube, Facebook, Twitter, all the handles. But if you go to YouTube and look under Debbie Bettendorf, it's find it. I'd love for you to subscribe. And then studio 11, the number 11 style.com. 
where on a scale from one to 10, you're an 11. You can check me out there. And I plan to go live on all platforms and have an app by October 1st. So, so cool. I can't wait to support you in that. And we might even have to work in some hemp clothes because that's what you can make out of it too. (laughs) Everyone loves hemp. So and at the count of three, we're going to say heal the world. That is the mission here to reach a billion people by 2025 about the power of this miracle plan, especially in the raw form. We say heal the world so people can find it. People can and feel it. People can hear it and learn about the power of this miracle plan. So on the count of three, let's say heal the world. Ready? Here we go. One, two, three. Heal the world. All right. Well, thanks for swinging by, Debbie. And thanks, everyone, for listening in to the Miracle Plant Podcast. Be sure to tune in next week to learn more about this miracle plant and how it's changing people's lives in extraordinary ways. Be a blessing, everybody, and happy healing. Thanks for listening to today's show. To check out more great cannabis podcasts, go to podconnects.com. Here's a preview of one of our other shows. Tune into a major journey podcast today, where guests take listeners on journeys and immerse themselves in the roller coaster ride both in and out of the cannabis space that brought them to where they are today. Throughout our conversations, guests share valuable lessons that they've learned along the way that listeners can use to empower growth both in their personal and professional lives. Check out a major journey today on all major podcast platforms.